Well, hi, everybody, and good Wednesday morning to you. We've reached the middle of the week, one week away from the Christmas holiday, and the weather remains on the quiet side. A frontal boundary is stalled out in northeast Nebraska, came to the south as a cold front. It's going to become a warm front and push eastward today, so we are not going to have to deal with the really cold air that sits to our northeast. That high pressure that's just south of uh, uh, Minneapolis, Minnesota, it is bitterly cold up there. The winds are, or the temperatures are below zero this morning in Minneapolis, but we won't have to see anything like that today. We're going to warm things up with a west and southwest wind that gets a little breezy out there. Mainly sunny skies, just maybe a couple of serious clouds passing through, but we should see a lot of sunshine for today. And we see a nice jump in temperatures today. Yesterday didn't get as warm as expected for most of us. Most of us stayed in the 30s. It was in the mid 30s in the Tri Cities. Today we take a nice step upwards with our high temperatures. Overnight tonight, still cold out there. It'll be mostly clear, becoming partly cloudy towards tomorrow morning morning i think we are going to see a few clouds pass through during the day tomorrow but despite that still managing to get into the 40s for tomorrow those clouds will be a little thicker later in the day and into tomorrow night especially here um, that cold front off to our north that maybe just cools us back a degree or two as we get towards your friday we're not looking at a big drop in temperatures but as we get to the weekend that's where the good stuff comes in. Highs today, topping out in the 40s, a few low 50s off towards the southwest. Areas to the southwest are pretty much snow-free, so it's going to be a little bit easier to warm up there. Uh, 30s off towards the east and northeast, closer to the really cold air that's off to our east. Um, still a lot of snow on the ground, but we should get some good melting today with a lot of sunshine. Back down into the teens overnight tonight, maybe a couple of lower 20s, so... Uh, average to just barely above average lows expected tomorrow's temperature still back into the 40s despite a few more clouds around uh maybe not the 50s off to the southwest like what we we have in store for today it might get close to 50 but i don't think it'll be quite as warm there and then as we get into your friday again maybe not as warm as previously expected still getting into the 40s in most spots though for your friday and a lot more sunshine returning maybe a few early morning clouds out there but still nice uh a nice way to wrap up the work week, but it's the weekend that looks awesome. Look at this forecast here. Again, the 40s in the next few days. The overnight lows will start to inch their way up as we approach the weekend. The weekend looks fantastic. Lots of sunshine, mid, low to mid 50s. Excellent weather, no problems whatsoever. No chance of precipitation. First day of winter is uh, on Sunday, and it won't feel like winter at all, which is just fine with me. Now, Monday, we start to see more clouds come in. Some cooler air is going to approach from the north, so we may not quite make it to 50 now on Monday. That's uh, I've dropped that forecast high a little bit here, uh, but still upper 40s, not bad. More clouds coming in by Christmas Eve. No precipitation on Christmas Eve, though, and even Christmas Eve night, it looks like it should stay dry for that Tuesday of Christmas Eve. Um, but it will be a little cooler, low to mid 40s for high temperatures for next Tuesday. What's beyond that? That's kind of the big question right now. I've been talking about it all week long so far, and really forecast models have been insisting on at least a chance of precipitation returning either Christmas Day or Christmas night. Um, I'm still on board with that as the European models have been indicating some light rain, but the big question mark is, will this just be a rain event on Christmas or could it be more of a wintry mix of precipitation? Forecast models are still unsure of that right now. One of the recent forecast models brings in a good chance of ice on Christmas Day, but that's still an outlier right now. That is not the consistent thing that forecast models are showing, so I'm not going to get into detail with that right now. So precipitation, a decent chance of it on Christmas Day or Christmas night. Will it be just rain or wintry precipitation? That's still kind of the question that's yet to be answered. As we look at the temperature trend, though, as we go through the next 10 days here, again, we go from above average in the next three days to way above average over the weekend, and then start to drop those temperatures back by Christmas Day and into the following days after that. Not a big shot of cold air, but a little cooler, closer to our average high by the end of next week. Some forecast models are hinting at maybe a big shot of cold air towards the New Year's holiday where we might see more of an Arctic blast return, although we might just get a glancing blow from that. It looks like once again, it may be worse off to our north and east as they've been seeing recently just like this morning for instance that may be the case again with this next shot if it happens but that's still over a week and a half away yet so we've got a long ways to get to that so that's going to wrap it up here as i said that's not too complicated of a forecast until we get into christmas day and at this point here uh, of course that's not in the seven day forecast uh, it will be for tonight for tim on the news at five six and ten i'll have that in the forecast tomorrow and again it's going to take a few more days before we start to gain a little more confidence in how that will exactly play out here because there still are plenty of question marks on it what if we'll see precipitation and what kind we will see at this point here so with that and i will tell you right now most forecast models keep it as rain so that's the hope that we have 
for Christmas here. We'll, we'll we'll wait and see here. And again, if we hit 39, again, that would be mostly a rain event. It's just if we drop below freezing or not, that could be a bigger problem. So with that, I will let you all go. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Have a good Wednesday. Enjoy the warmer weather. Enjoy the snowmelt for today. We'll see you all again coming up on Thursday morning. Take care. Bye.